I mean, the hair is looking amazing in a wild way, but it's super hot in here. I'm melting down. Hi humans, Lord Jigo's back, and funny here, I'm just the resident man who's been trying to survive in this planet. And today's video, it's actually a... I, I was going to say a different video because this one doesn't have a script, but none of my videos have one. That's why it's so good! Amazing. So, what I want to talk about in this video is something that I've been like overthinking about it lately a lot and it's the fact that I, I just turned 25 years old some months ago and suddenly I started feeling like a child like a, a, a person who doesn't know what's going on in the planet and that's weird because I have always been the kind of kid who knew everything who always knew what to do who you know those kids that you can actually talk with like uh, an, an adult and they have an answer for everything and they kind of know th some things about everything but since I, I, I turned 25 I started feeling like I know nothing but not only about the planet itself or things that we should know about but even the things that I thought I knew, even the things that just involved myself, I, I started feeling that I don't know anything. It's like my life just restarted. I don't know, since I turned like 25 years old, I started feeling like my mind just pressed a button and just erased and deleted everything that my mind was sure about and it's weird for me because i have never been lost i mean i started working really young as a child technically and i have always knew what to do or even though on those moments that i knew i was scared of things scared of taking a step i have always knew what to do and what i wanted to do I mean, that, that, that's more for sure. What I wanted to do, and I knew that I needed to do something. I knew that I needed to change my reality because I didn't like it. And I knew what I wanted. And suddenly I got to a moment that, I mean, my self-esteem got so low that I started feeling that I couldn't do anything. Like, I, 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 I would never be able to do pretty much anything. And I was useless, the dumbest person, and suddenly that changed to thanks to a person, and which probably watching this video. I mean, you should be watching this video. <laughs> joking, not joking. And suddenly that changed, and I could look at myself again and, and look at other things that I could do and how my brain works and how I'm able to do things, how I am able to get things done, even on periods that life's trying to murder me. Not in the fun way, not in the fun way. And, <laughs> but that person showed me that, oh, you're capable of doing anything. You're gay, you can do it. You can always find a way to deal with things because you were smart and I, I started like knowing myself again or just realizing that I was wasting time like hating myself because of things people did to me and it wasn't about me it wasn't about those people the moment that I started like believing in myself again that I could see that I was capable of getting things done of getting my dreams and make them true, make them become reality. I started like, it actually, that started like changing some months ago. I started feeling like I don't know anything anymore. I don't know anything about myself. I don't know anything about what I want. And that's weird because I have always had answers for anything. I have always had answers to 
literally anything, but now I just feel that I, I, I'm in a process, and I don't know if I'll get an answer for that, but I'm in a process of realizing that I don't know anything, and I don't know pretty much anything about me, and that's not a bad thing, because it's fun to have a mystery, but I don't know what I want, I, I mean, I, I, I know some things I want, I know some things I don't want, and that's a priority to change it, and, but, I mean, things about the future, I don't know if I, what I want, I don't know what to do, and I just feel like, I mean, I, I had a whole schedule in my mind, but it was basically a, a, a robot schedule. You're going to do this, to get this, doing this, to get this. But now I'm just like, okay, I can do a ton of things to get a ton of different, I mean, answers and change my reality to things. And I have a lot of possible roads to take. But what I want, I mean, after I turned 25, and that's weird to say, I, I I literally just cut my nose. I literally just cut my nose. Jesus. Yeah, I, I'm still harming myself. But more than just decisions or things I want for my future, because I don't know what I want or if I want things, I, I'm starting to, like, it, it really feels like I'm being reborn or I was reborn, it's like my, my mind It's in the process of deleting files and starting over because even things like food or like I used to love cooking and baking and I stopped doing that for a moment it was just like my mind was deleting those files and I, I start doing it again but in a different way, it was like the sensations I used to have with my body and my mind just changed a bit. Like, I, 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 I'm literally starting things over, but things that I used to do, things that I used to like, but some things I still like, like cooking or baking, I, I still love that. But th some, some things I just stopped liking, but even the things that I like, it's like it has a different taste now. Or the way I'm doing it, it's different. And even when I think about flavors and things that... I mean, I started loving salads for some reason. Oh, no. Are you serious? It's not what it looks right like. Right in front of my salad? That's yeah. not what it looks like. You guys are fucking gross. And that wasn't me before. I mean, I, 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 of course, I used to eat it because, I mean, trying to stay healthy. But now I like the taste of it, and that's tr that's strange. That's weird. Of course, something that will never change. It's that I love coffee, and you should love coffee too. Because if you don't love coffee, I hate you. Really. And even people that I used to keep in my life that I knew they were a problem, or I knew that they weren't a match in my life and I'm talking about friendship, I started, like, basically realizing what was going on around me, and just feeling like, oh, but why I do this? Or even, I, I wake up every day, and the first thing that I do is water, is watering my plants, and I started like, okay, but why that's the first thing I do when I wake up? Maybe I would like to do something different. Maybe I would like to drink a cup of water. And my mind started like doing a process of realizing what I do normally every day. And my brain just decided that, no, we're going to start over. Forget everything you know about yourself and everything you know about like life and everyday life and small decisions, big decisions. And, oh, you like to wear orange. Why? Let's do something different. And let's revisit that decision that 
feeling that you used to feel about those things and let's see if you like it like right now because I just deleted the files and I just feel like I, I, I'm I mean rediscovering myself in a way but also I feel like I'm starting over things I'm starting over in my life is, is that is that I mean too crazy or have you ever like felt like this that you got in a moment in your life like in my case, I just turned 25 and my mind just clicked and changed for some reason. And everything you knew, everything you felt, or even decisions that you made a long time ago, or even a year ago, your mind just decided to delete everything and start over. And I mean, like discovering life and normal things again. And it's weird because there are things now that I don't like, that I used to like. And there are things that I used to hate, and now I just feel, oh, maybe that's nice. Maybe I like those kinds of people. Maybe, no, I still hate cats. I hate cats, and I'll, 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 I mean, there, there is, like, there are, like, true truths about life, about at least my life. I love coffee. And I hate cats. That's it. That's never gonna change. I mean, unless I'm, I mean, like, single forever, and I have to, like have cats because when you're single for over like thirty years, you kind of need to have cats because they suck your soul, so you don't feel things. And <laughs> that was this video. It's just me talking nonsense about something uh, I'm feeling. And tell me if you have ever had this moment in your life that you just felt that everything you knew, you don't know. And everything you liked, you don't know if you like it or not. And just like being reborn. I, I Have you ever, I mean, like, have you ever felt like your mind just decided to reset everything? And start over and I mean literally everything because I mean I don't even know what colors I want to wear I don't even know if I like my face or not I mean you like it you like my face I know so that was this video it was just me being crazy about life again Th that didn't change unfortunately and that was this video and i hope you enjoyed and i hope you could understand what i said because i sometimes i feel that i talk a lot and 90 percent of it doesn't make sense because once the brain makes the words get out of my mouth it's just twist the sense of it and i love y'all thank you be safe and if you're single don't adopt cats have dogs, not cats, never cats. We all hate cats. But I woo woo it hurts.